<laughs> Hello everybody, welcome to the TriStar Gym channel. Today I'm filming with Fox, guys. We haven't had Fox since the whole world crisis we talked about. The word we don't mention on this channel. We're not allowed to mention on this channel. Fox, welcome back. How you been? Good, good. Glad to see you. Uh, training. You're still uh, in tip-top shape, training every day. <laughs> in the laboratory, figuring out <laughs> master details. This man's been doing jiu-jitsu. You're still doing seven days a week? Yeah. Guys. It's a disease at this point. It is. It's a disease. It's a mental illness. It is. That's why I have mental to go Mental illness the pool. is real. Mental <laughs> illness is real. Guys, 20 years, over 20 years ago, I used to go to Henzo's. He used to train seven days a week. Yeah. Seven days a week tw times 20, 365 <laughs> times 20. That's an insane amount of jujitsu time. Guys, what today you're going to get, you're going to get some gems. But you guys are, you guys are, you better like this channel. You better like it. You better upvote. You better check out. I'm going to put your, uh, uh, website and app in the description guys sounds great make Thank sure you. okay you guys are benefiting from this man's mental illness he's in the gym <laughs> seven days a week insanity <laughs> even me i take a day off even me it's <laughs> incredible yeah, incredible okay so tell me you now he fox tells me taking the back is good obviously but hooks are overrated now normally i tell the guy he's crazy for saying that but because it's fox I think we're about to see something super special, okay? So <laughs> tell me, explain to me how <laughs> hooks are overrated. I, what we've been taught since day one. So the hooks. we're actually going to demonstrate. Really? So I've been sort of playing with a lot of diff different back takes over the last, I don't know how many years, but especially the last three years, I've really been focused on a different way to do the back take. And it, it's kind of funny. Once I lock the position that I want, there is no <laughs> escape. Whereas I have seen high-level guys... Even in MMA, you see this, they you just, know, the guys on his they back. They just out. They just, they you know, hold out. on and, you know, do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean. But also they get out sometimes. They yeah, yeah. Out of like, but they're not using a technique almost. Yeah. It's like, they spaz out. True. And I think a lot of, this is what kind of one of the disappointing things for me in MMA, which, uh, you know, is, is that high-level guys, many high-level guys know a lot of, of anti-jiu-jitsu, but not enough to jiu-jitsu so uh, mm. they just kind of want to get out and that's it whereas they're you know, big strong athletes yeah they're sweaty there's a time constraint they're using a lot of strength and the regular joe can't he wouldn't escape that way no you know no but obviously we have to learn to develop our jiu-jitsu that we can control everybody even the big strong guy who's sweaty and can you know force himself out I, i'm gonna show you and and guys by the way this we didn't pre prep this no, no, no. this is on the fly <laughs> this is gonna be we were talking Hooks are not as and, uh, important as everybody thinks. Film, why? Why are, why are hooks not as important as everybody thinks? So I think where people have, if you look at the, the, the evolution of, of the, the game has evolved tremendously mm -hmm. the last five, seven, ten years, but, you know, due to video, it's, it's just available. And a lot of people like body triangles. I, I, I don't like body triangle for two reasons. One is, is, is if the guy twists the wrong way, it, it hurts my own mm -hmm. leg. And the other thing is it prevents me from moving to the position okay. where I want to be. But then there's an attempt to control the hips better because with the hooks, you know, and, and, and I think, um, you know, the more modern scoring of, of, of tournaments awards, you know, four, depending on the, on the right, circuit, right, four right. points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we'll, I'll, I'll show you. We, you know, show, I'm me, show me, show me. Show me how you configure so, your legs. I'm very curious. So this is, this is where, you know, the, the traditional. Can you, t t can you move up? Forward or up? Uh, up, 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 yeah. up, up. Yeah. Just, yeah. Just like that. Okay. Can you move? Yeah. Can you move down? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I can. Um, can you twist a little bit? So I'm controlling your shoulders through my hand grips, right? Mm -hmm. But your hips can move from side. Yes. Yeah, yeah. This is a problem. It's one of my favorite stations. Yes. This is a problem. I start shimming like this. Yeah. It's one of my favorites. If yeah. you have a good back, this is good to do. Yeah. That's a problem. So, when I get the back, and somebody lost the mic, I think it's, it's just because I wanted to oh. sound good. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. So, from, we'll do it from maybe from a turtle, but what I usually do is um, I put my foot on the hip. The second foot goes on the hip, mm -hmm. and I try to go to here. So, even if I, so can you move up? Ah, so you're controlling the feet on the hips instead of feet in the thighs. Yeah. Instead of down here. Yeah. Can you show them the contrast? Because a lot of people won't see the So when, when you're here, you this can... This is what you everybody does. Puts their hooks yeah. in the thighs. So 
you can slide right. up to right. defend. There's nothing stopping me from sliding up. So sometimes if you get really caught deep and it's really late, one of the best ways to defend is to pin the guy down and slide up, slide up. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this, this makes the choke, it's possible, but it's way really less effective now. Okay. The other way is also, so I do control your positioning down. So if you want to slide down, yeah. It's possible when I have my hooks here, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So what I try to do is this. Mm -hmm. So now I control, so It's you kind of like what we do in guard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you cannot slide up. No. I can't go up anymore. Can you slide down? No, so this thigh, this thigh is blocking my armpit. So I don't want to stay here. So when I, I can't even lock it right now, but if I lock the body triangle, I become a little bit more static. I don't want to be static. What I'm looking to do is as you struggle. So a lot of times when the guys sort of start to fail with the back attack, they try to go for an arm bar. And the guy knows it, so he's timing me as I bring. That's a big movement. Yeah. So literally, when I'm here, your only possibility is to give me an armbar. I will not take it. You give it to me, and then I just extend. That's it. Again, I'm making you make the big move. So the only way you could do it is put your head. If you do this, I will continue to. Mm -hmm. Once I'm here, mm -hmm. this, is, this is bad. This is extremely bad for you. So I'm aiming. Yeah, I'm aiming. This is where I'm aiming. It doesn't matter. If, if I, if I actually, I'm going to, if I lock up a triangle, mm -hmm. it's like how in, in MMA, what are you going to do here? I'm dead here. Yeah. Like, uh, I mean, I would go for this leg. I would try to unlock the leg, but it's I not going to happen. It's a losing battle for me. Yeah. This is not going to, yeah. I, and at the same time, what I'm doing is I'm, yeah, this is literally, so this is where I'm going with, with my back takes. And you know, when people do this, they want to lock up under the extended arm. So they will try to make the guy fall to this side so they can get a mm -hmm, cleaner mm -hmm. choke. Yes, yes. But again, why? How do you feel here? Do you feel any possible way for you to escape? I feel your left knee is really crushing me, crushing yeah. my escape because I cannot get yeah, this I'm elbow. actually going to be squeezing. Uh, I can't get my left elbow close to my body because this knee here is blocking, is blocking me. So this is where... I'm aiming for a back take. Literally, once I lock this, people are not, not escaping. Mm. I've had my high-level black belts escaping from, uh, from the traditional back take. It's, it's great. I, you know, I turtle them up. I do the rolling back take, put the hooks in, looking for the choke. Only, and especially MMA, when guys do, they a lot of time wind up on top. Mm. And that's, a, that's, that's catastrophic in MMA. It's horrible. Yeah. Can I, can I try? Yeah, absolutely. <clears throat> So should I take off the mic? No, no, you're okay. I'll, okay. I'll, be, I'll be careful. So, so see, like I can try to get right. my, you know, I can right. slide down. Right. Right. But again, if I, if it's really late stage defense, I can slide up. Mm. Whereas if you put your foot, up, yeah, I can. But control this. So I control the hand, the arm. I focus on the arm and I pull at the elbow. Not yes. No. Oh. <laughs> sorry, sorry. But you see the difference here. Mm, this is I, no good. This. Got to flare the elbow. Yeah, but do you see how my. Guys, this is the key. In Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, the slightest, this looks the same as this one. Mm. It's not. Mm. From here, I feel, you know, I'm in a horrible position, but I feel comfortable. I, I don't feel any pain. Once, yeah, I feel pain. And I'm basically, for, mm. yeah, I now, my mobility is compromised. The elbows flared out. Yes, always. You don't want no, no, no. I feel like he can get over his elbow. Now. He can get his upper body. Yeah. So sometimes I can go. Yeah. You know, yeah. But once you go ahead, that's not so easy. Sorry, sorry, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's that's. Okay. Yeah. This is kind of uh, one of my black belts. He said he seems he moved to Texas. They asked him how was it rolling with Fox. He said intricate pain compliance. <laughs> so yeah, you basically. My mobility is severely impacted. Mm -hmm. If I want to escape, there's not a whole lot I can do right now. So what I would try to do is possibly slip this and put my head to the floor. But basically, I'm giving you the arm off. Mm 
Right. But if I don't do anything, right, mm. what you're going to do is you're going to keep slow. So keep slowly pulling here. So sometimes, yeah. Am I climbing? Uh, Am I passing my foot? No, cross, cross your ankles first. Yes. And turn. Yes. Once, once you, yeah. you down. Yeah, yeah. This is uh, mm. nice and easy because the, yeah, yeah, yeah. this is. So I feel right, like it's sub you here almost. Yeah. With the arm. So you can actually sub me with like almost like a weird triangle mm. uh, sort of. Uh, Should I keep climbing up? I feel like I have to yeah. keep climbing up. Yes. Lock the triangle, please. Mm. That's actually easy. Mm. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm at a break. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. And tuck it underneath here. Right, right. And then. So hold on to the arm. So if you start to pull the arm, that's a submission. Right. But you also have the submission on the neck if you do the thigh mask just squeeze. Right. You know? But in MMA, it doesn't matter. I cannot hit you. No, no, you there's can't. no way I can hit you. But you can hit me repeatedly course, with course. just one hand. You're finished here. Yeah. There's not a whole lot other than signal to the right. To the referee, <laughs> please. I think you can do that. Right? <laughs> I'm done. You're finished. This is the end. <laughs> but you can see how pulling on that elbow, it literally. I feel, like, I feel like I can tap you here. Yes, you can. This is wedging. You can tap me multiple ways. Right. There's not nothing I can do right now. Yeah. I, I can arm bar you even <laughs> yes. just with the try. It's yes. It's just a horrible, horrible mangle. So we're here like this. So again, this is, for me, this is a bad position you just scored, but I feel okay. Mm. I feel okay. And see how you focus. I focus on the arm. Do you understand yes. what I'm saying? You so, got to grab that Kimura. Yes. Because right now, you are controlling not just the arm, but you're controlling the way I move. If, if I can turn this mm -hmm. towards you. So if I can clear this foot, mm -hmm. I can mm -hmm. turn that yeah. way. You start to pull that, that, that becomes uh, impossible. Because that's what I was going to ask you. He's going to try to get over my foot. He's going to try to shrimp to his left. Yes. So a lot of times, can you go back, please, for a second? Uh, go back. If, yeah, here. Yeah, okay. If I can do this, I'm out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But if you pull, yeah, I, can't, I, can't, I cannot do this. I have to, sorry, yeah, I have yeah. to lift your elbow. Flare yeah. it off the ground, yeah, yeah. up towards your shoulder. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Right. Can, you put me, can you put me in this position? I want to yeah, yeah. We, we, we need a stunt man for this. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Man. Oh. Uh -oh. So let's do, let's do the we, same angle. Can we do it a little bit more? Can I put you in, in there a little bit? So when the guy turtles up, right, and I go rolling back take. So I'm, I'm going to do rolling back take. So I start with attacking the neck, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. And basically what I'm doing is, so now I'm on the other side. Okay. So I'm on the other side. It doesn't matter. Mm -hmm. Should we stay on the same side or no? Uh, I would stay on the same side first okay. until so we finish do the uh, rolling back take from, from there. Let's, so I got to do it. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Let's uh, try to get the same angle if we can. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, when the guy turtles up, yeah. so I do rolling back mm -hmm. take. See how, this is what I call cradle. That's People try looking. to get the hooks. Let's rotate, rotate, rotate. So... I call this the cradle. Okay. So you have Feel a the difference between in my level of control over this, whereas people try to do mm -hmm. this immediately. Here, I feel like I can get it over this. Yes. Side. And this is where people tend to. So here, you know, when somebody's back is being taken, they they're going to extreme uh, defensive position. So here, it's a great position. I just scored, but as far as control, I'd rather have this. Mm -hmm. Your butterfly hook. Is behind my yeah. hip, and I'm kind of squeezing my thighs. And your thighs are squeezing. So I just took took you back, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna control the arm. I don't. Sorry. I, let me just position the mic. Sorry. Yeah. You gotta be careful for the mic. Yeah. So it, immediately I go from from this or this to controlling your arm. Okay. So right now I don't need to control. So if you try to turn to your left, I can neutralize that. Your left leg is blocking my hip from going to the mat. And this. And this flare. Yeah. Show me how you would flare, flare, flare. I see. Okay. No, I can't turn left. No. But what's... Okay, so I can't turn left. That I feel like... Honestly, go I can't ahead, turn go left. Go to the right. But I feel mm -hmm. like I maybe could jump over this hook. What's stopping me from clearing this hook? Oh, so you're, you're, you're stripping up. I'm moving you actively up. Uh -huh, so, uh -huh. But do you see how this... You can jump. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, I see. I see this elbow here. <sighs> Can you relax this second? Is it okay? Yeah. So for some reason, for some reason, yeah, this is stopping me from shrimping. Yeah, I don't know. I understand Intricate why. Intricate pain compliance. <laughs> this is what's what uh, reduces your mobility. You're pushing my hand down in this direction. Yeah. 
and you're pushing my elbow in the opposite direction. It's the same way you would take a kimura. So mm -hmm. if you have a super strong guy, you're on top, you take a kimura. If you try to pull the, the wrist from his, from his belly, from the protective area, it's not gonna happen. But this, mm -hmm. you yeah. can see how that everything's, yeah. So I can, for some reason, yeah, yeah, I see what you're doing. So now I'm gonna bring you to the, and mm -hmm. from here, mm -hmm. I immediately cross my ankles. Mm -hmm. From here? I'm dead here. Yeah, I go into, so from here, I can stay. If you got short legs, triangle's not your thing. Yeah, you don't need yeah. to close the triangle. Now, from here, you have no strength because your, your elbow is above your shoulder. So if I, if I want to close the triangle, I can let go. Can you bring that arm back? No, no, I'm in trouble, I'm dead. This is, this is just absolutely brutal. It's brutal. From here, again, in MMA, you know where the guy's punching in the back of the head? Mm. But, you know, from, yeah, yeah. that's not gonna happen. I wish you guys could feel this at home. Let me try. <laughs> <laughs> but you can see how that- Cradle, guys, cradle, no more hooks. <laughs> the problem is, guys, you may not, you're not getting points for that. Points. <laughs> I want the guy dead. I don't want points. <laughs> so, okay, so here things are loose. Yeah. I, let me do it on the side. Yeah. Here I have the Kimura. We fall to yeah, the, this is, the over. The so my side. foot goes on the Boom. Head. Yeah. Here. And I need to create tension on this one. Yeah, this yeah. is what's controlling you. Yeah, yeah. You need, okay, I see what's going on. You need this elbow down for your, for your. Yeah, yeah, I need, this allows me to move. Right, now, right. Yeah, uh, that's not. Just, just one thing. I need to push your, what I'm seeing is, I'm pushing your left elbow yes. up. Yes. I'm pushing your left hip up. That's what's stopping your right hip from, from coming up. Yeah. Because if I relax this, your right hip can come up off the ground. If it comes up off the ground, now you're going to start hurtling over my foot. Yeah, and then I'm. I'm I see I'm, what I'm, you're doing. I see what you're doing. You're forcing the guy yeah. towards his right. Yeah, this really sucks. He wants, you want to get to your left, but you can't. Yeah, and, and actually, I'm feeling, I'm starting to feel the constriction in your right arm. Mm. So, yeah, I, I got to turn my head because otherwise, I'm, eventually, I'm going to go see out. see what you're doing here. I see it's basically like what we did in Kimura. So, I'm going to try, so I'm going to see how, so I'm going to try to jump over. Right. Now, bring me back easy. Don't, don't bring me back like. So bring me back, bring me, bring, so, so you, no, see. Oh no, bring you back see, the other way. Yes, yes, but see, use this. You're gonna have to show me that one. Yeah. Oh, no, yeah. sorry, sorry. Yeah. Now I feel, <laughs> I, have, I have control over your arm, that's controlling your hips. Yeah, yeah. Now I'm up in the cradle again here. Yeah, and what I would do is clear this arm. Yeah. How do I clear your arm? So I'm gonna, so a lot of time the guy blocks it, but Lead with your lead with your knee. Don't lead with your foot. Lead with your knee. Cross your ankles immediately. Cr cross your ankles. Mm. Yeah, yeah, this is, yeah, this is. Yeah, this is. See what's going on. It's me. Usually, I'm here like this. Yeah, you're you're keeping me like more yeah. pressure. Sorry. <laughs> I hope I can move tomorrow. Sorry, right. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> but you can see how. <laughs> this is this is awesome. Yeah. Now, from here. You know, again, people try to turn the guy to the other side right. to lock it up yes, under yes. the extended arm. We lift the no, arm up no. and we shift hips. Just hold on There's to no this arm. To. You can There's hold no on with to. one hand now, mm -hmm. right? Right. Now, reach for your shin and lock it. Right. Yeah. And high, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, <laughs> mm -hmm. show, me, show me it again. I want to see how you shifted from one side to the other. Yeah. That was, uh, <sighs> you right? Yeah, yeah. I, I'm, I'm getting what you're doing. This, He's, yeah. he's flaring my elbow and he's stopping me from rotating. Yeah. That, that elbow yeah. control is creating a lot of tension all the way down to my hips. So I, I had one of my students, he was at, a, at like an eight man, he, he's only 170 pounds, but he was in the eight man bracket, mm -hmm. uh, absolute. So mm -hmm. it was some big boys. And he took the guys back two minutes into the match and rode him for eight minutes. Really? I'm screaming very specific instructions. This is what I wanted him to go to. We talked about it afterwards and he's like, I said, did you not hear me? He said, no, I heard you. She didn't feel it. I said, she said, no, I didn't feel it. I said, all right. So the next two days, I just, we just did this. Mm. The next time he trained with like elite black belts, he subbed the guy twice doing this. And the third time it was the traditional way because the mm. guy was defending the new way. Right, 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 right. He was scared of the first attack <laughs> and the second attack pops up. <laughs> Show me again, grab my, my back please, Fox. So. How, uh, do you want to try to enter it in a no, little I bit more? Exactly, exactly what we just did. Like n nothing new. Okay. Okay. So I'm here like so, this. So see, so see, as 
I'm already putting. No, no, hold on, hold on. Yeah. We saw the other side there, the last one. It doesn't matter. No, 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 yeah, yeah, but I don't know. I just want to remain consistent. Okay. So yeah, let's, let's. I want because a lot of people are going to get confused if we. Okay, so we're we're here. Yeah. We're here. I want to just if my elbow's down here. Yeah, you I can, can move. I can move to yeah. the left. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now look, I just realized that I've been and I've wedged my. Yeah, I, I, I've been lacking this detail, guys. Uh, can can you go back? Oh, sorry. The elbow has to be flared up. Your your arm is underneath my elbow, and you're just forcing my elbow north. Yeah. Right? Say say you're really strong. I can't. So I'm I'm you utilizing this for one. support, and I could also do uh -huh, this. Uh -huh. I see what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I see how I'm yeah, stretching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Try, I can't. I cannot. I cannot you, jump. I'll over let this. you jump over this because you, I, I see you. I can strip it, but mm, I see what you're doing. But again, it's this control that turns. Mm, it creates you. a tension. Yeah. That's good. If I if I go over here, boom. Yeah, you you're lifting me up. Uh, from here, mm -hmm, yeah. if, if like try to block, try to block my foot coming over your mm -hmm, arm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I see. I see your shrimp. Your shrimp. I see what you do. So even if the guy, Knee so first. Let, you, normally when I try to lead with the foot, he's gonna track the foot. Mm -hmm, so you're mm -hmm. gonna try to stop the foot. Mm -hmm. and then I just mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. from here, mm -hmm. I will cross over. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I can lock up. I'm sorry. No, no, you're Again, this is extremely painful, guys. Mm -hmm. It is, it is. I'm squeezing, but I also Try have, you know, again, you can be creative. You can, you, obviously, mm -hmm. if you want to play prison rules, you got <laughs> wrist locks, which I tend not to use. You know, you can try to stick it under your <sighs> armpit. Mm -hmm. I'm not letting go. The only possible way he can escape is to unravel the yeah, top Yeah, yeah. I have to pop this. It's not going to happen. Oh, man, this is tight, guys. You don't have much time to work here. No. Things are breaking, blood flow. And it, it, it just, it's a finishing move, but it also is very painful while you, mm -hmm, while it you're is. in it. Definitely painful, and you're running out of, you're running out of blood. The blood's not circulating through your head. The other thing is what's good is, is especially if you're dealing with, you know, at a high level, you're dealing with guys that are, first of all, they are willing to take a break. They're willing to, to, uh, to kind of bust through that. By take a break, he means letting your arm break. Yeah. That's what he's trying to say. Or go out. This one is just basically, it takes the sails out from under you because you, or away from me, I'm not quite sure what the, because you feel there's, not, there's no answer. Mm. I love it. Can we do it again? Yeah, Let's, for sure. Uh, take the back. Yeah. So Guys, yeah. We're not putting the hooks in. We're not closing body triangles. We're creating So anytime the I take the guys back, let's assume that, so if, if I did a rolling back take, what I'm going to do is instead of, so instead of uh, getting, you know, this, you feel, again, we've been conditioned by the, basically by the rule set to do this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Again, now a lot of guys close the triangle because it's, it's a better control than this. But, for example, IBJJF, you do not get points for that. So this is even better, I believe. So mm -hmm. I love the counter pressure. So again, if I need a little bit more, if the guy keeps it really low, mm -hmm. yeah. and I move, mm -hmm. yeah. I can turn you to the other side at my leisure. And I'm constantly putting pressure on it. Uh -huh. And you're done. This, again, if when I get, yeah, this, is that a tap or just pre-tap? <laughs> it's just brutal. I don't even have to close the triangle. It's just completely. I love it. <laughs> I love it, man. <laughs> it's kind of like combining back control and kimura. It's such yeah. a strong yeah. control again. Yeah. You know, it's such a beautiful way to control. So again, we fall to this side, right? But immediately, yeah. So comparing this. I think we were, we were controlling this hand if we're staying on the same side. So I'm actually falling to this side. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, it's nice and easy. Oh, so yeah, constantly, yeah, that's tension. It does not. Mm. So right now, so, you know, sometimes people, um, if you br let my elbow come down for a little bit, see how now I know that you cannot get on top unless you get this knee to the ground. You understand if you were to heist? So yes. if, I, if I were to jump over this, yes, yes, yes. you cannot get to, my, to, 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 to mount because I'm pinning no, your no, knee. Yeah, I'm pinning, yeah, I need to retract. Watch what happens to my weight in the lower back as you start to pull on the elbow. Start to pull it. Mm. Now, if you want, you can turn me to, if you want to I turn me. I shifted your weight more down towards yeah. the ground, yeah. off my right leg. And it's, yeah. so it's, yeah, I no longer control my weight. You can go to this side. Yeah. <laughs> You're basically, it kind of feels a lot like guard. You're doing it like, like what yeah. would you do in guard? You would do it here. Yeah, 
Exactly. So we're, you know, think about it. It's like a reverse guard. It's a guard. Except you trace it. Can you go to my guard a second? Yeah. Yeah. Like, it feels so much like. Yeah. Basically. <laughs> like, just this, basically. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. maybe I would grab a Kimura here. You know, yeah. reverse Kimura. Yeah, yeah. And so yeah, it's just kind of like the same thing. Except here, I don't have your elbow flared. Yeah. But but if you think about it, like here, again, you know, feet on the hips, feet on the mm -hmm. hips. Yeah, like you're in an extremely controlling position. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why not do it from the back? Yeah. Should we call it back guard? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we gotta come up with a good name. <laughs> don't forget where you learned it. Guys, forget your hooks, forget your triangle, back triangles. Aim for putting your feet on the hips and create tension in that kimura, elevate that elbow, create tension, and now your opponent is your puppet. <laughs> I love this one, man. I can't wait to try it today. I'm going to be rolling today. That's all I'm going to go for. Thank you so much, Fox. My pleasure. Thank you. Honestly. Always Guys, love being up here. Check in the description. Fox has an app. He has content on a website as well, right? Fluid BJJ. And also, we have a YouTube channel. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share, and I'll bring him back more often. Thank you so